so without using this because it's it's been the best thing for the uh, past over four years it's holding all the crystals charm chains beads frame and it's keep it they stay on one place it's last up to four to six weeks unless you're taking off earlier so i'm gonna go ahead and using there's several different designs that i am going to do with you and it's one of the really cool that we are going to using the extra thick condensed glue gel. So the newest, like a last couple months, let's have it. So then that way you can use it for your big, huge crystals, which is I am going to use on one of the nails today. So let's use that. We're not using both of them. So let's see which one we want to pick in the thick one. Maybe this one. The dreamy purple. So let me pick just uh about a good sign like us about the same size i would get the same size of the purse when i pick up this Oh, hold on. Which one are you? This one. Dreamy purple. And we're going to using it and place it right. You can do it like the middle of the nails. You can do it on the uh, cuticle areas. Do however you would like and you prefer your crystals going to be. So I'm using a big crystals and then we are going to using a little bit of a no wipe top coat. Make sure you close your um, condensed glue gels. Leads on. You don't want it just hanging there when you're doing your client's nails. And it might the pro the um, the process might take a little bit longer. You don't want it to be here. Extremely. So I'm gonna do it and like make it like a triangle. So I'm gonna go ahead and. Have them really cool and leaned on each other. And then... Make sure they are born in with the condensed glue gels. And I'm gonna go ahead and using a little cute, it's like a 3D smaller crystal, which is in the uh, um, Easter collectible mix bag. So now, to in order to secure this before I move to the next one, I'm go ahead and flash clear this for 30 seconds. If you like it like that, if you wanna adjust thing, you wanna add some more, absolutely. And then flash here before we're moving further. And then now we're going to go into using our condensed glue gels. I haven't used any chains. I love the chains lately. Uh, the thing on one of my kits. Let me see if I have it in here. You do? Oh. They have a pink chains. I want to get the rose gold chains. There you go. So, we always go ahead. And apply the condensed glue gels this is the standard condensed glue gel which is already really nice and thick density so i'm gonna go ahead and apply all and tie the nails a good amount not too thick not too thin you want to be too thick it's gonna flood your crystal and you don't want to be too thin that it's not going to adhere to crystal properly so i'm gonna go ahead and apply it on and tie the nails 
including in the cuticle area i might add some crystal cube in here but hey as i say it's any any and any step you can stop at any like if you want just a crystal like this and you want to leave the ombre alone absolutely you don't have to um go further i'm gonna go ahead and pick this chains which is that i have it gathered from And we're not, I'm having post, I haven't applied any of the top coat yet. We can wrap it around here. Right there. Great. And now we are going to go ahead and using the no wipe top coat. So what I'm gonna do, I am gonna go ahead and even apply right on the top of the chain. We are going to go back again with the precision glue gel to make sure that the chains has got completely protects so it's prevent from getting tarnished um you know like wearing your nails clean the house doing a lot of normal work or washing your hand with a lot of hand sanitizer all right great floating right on the top and I want to using some of the is super adorable gloves crystal and that's couple there how's everyone doing so far so far so good mm -hmm. That's it. I'm gonna wipe up on the end. And you can add beads on, you can add more as you prefer. I still want to get some flash gels underneath. Cool. Yep. Cool. 